Hey, the Guaranteed Retirement Guy here, and I want to talk to you about types of annuities. So there's typically three types of annuities. You've got MIGAs, you've got fixed index, and you've got variable, okay? And we'll just, we'll just go over it briefly. So with MIGAs, they're called fixed annuities or multi-year guaranteed annuities, and they basically just pay you a fixed rate. When you think of a MIGA or you think of a fixed annuity, just think fixed, 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 okay? It's just, it never changes. If the market goes up, it doesn't matter. If the market goes down, it doesn't matter. You're getting that fixed rate. So if you're getting, if it's a 4%, great. If it's a 6%, great. And it's fixed for a certain period. So if it's five years, seven years, 10 years, doesn't matter. It is fixed for that period. And if you want to take that interest out and live off of it, you could. If you got a million bucks and you stick it into something with a 5% interest rate, then you're going to get 50000 a year um, until the end of that period. And then at the end of that period, you can roll it into something else because typically those fixed annuities will revert back to a lower rate of return after that period um, is ended. So it might go down to a 1% or 2%. All right. So that's the fixed side. Okay. The variable side, well, that's it's variable, so it goes all over the place. If you want to ride the roller coaster of the market, then you'll put your money into a variable annuity. But just remember, they can have some very, very high fees. Some of those fees can range anywhere anywhere between three and six percent. So you have to remember that you got a lot of different fees in there: advisory fees, a mutual fund fees, and annuity fees. And so, uh, a lot of times, you'll be promised some huge returns and some guaranteed income based off of those returns. But a lot of that can also be very, very unrealistic. So be wary when you look at those. A lot of times when people think about annuities and if they if they've heard bad things about annuities, it's because I think, in my opinion, um, from the variable side, just from some of the problems that people have had because their advisor did not tell them everything, uh, the ups and the downs, you know, the drawbacks of those types of annuities. So, so you got the variable here and you've got the fixed here. Now let's go to the middle of the road, which you have a fixed index annuity or what people call uh, an FIA. So these annuities kind of give you a little both. So the variable side, you know, it gives you a lot of growth if the market goes up, but the index can as well. But most of the time, the index will not give you as much as maybe a variable would because it's not directly invested into the stock market. And so because of that, um, you get a portion of the index earnings. So if the index earns maybe 10%, you might get seven or 8%. Sometimes you get more, it depends on the company you're with and it depends on the index and also what the cap is and what the participation rate is. So remember that, because sometimes an insurance company might buy call options associated with, let's say the S&P index, and if they, and if they get it at a very, very expensive price because you know maybe the market's volatile or, or the interest rates are all over the place, then a lot of times those call options are very, very expensive. And so when they're expensive, they might cap your rate at 6%. So if the, if the S&P does 10%, they're only going to give you 6 um, Or they might give you a participation rate of 50%. And so, you know, which means you'll just get 50% of whatever the index does. So the index does 15%, you'll get 7.5%. So that's how a fixed index annuity will work. But fixed index annuities also give you some guarantees. Um, you know, the variable you typically going up and down with the market. With the fixed index, it's not giving you a fixed rate over here, but it's not giving you any losses either. So what the floor might be is maybe a zero or a 1%. But most of these that I'm, I'm looking at, are there's usually a 0% floor built in. So if the market drops through the floor, you know, you don't have any losses. Your losses are just zero. So if you gain 10% the year before, then you have your 10% that you gain plus your principal balance. And then uh, if you have a down year, then it just stays where it is. And then it waits for the, for the next upswing. And once, once the uh, index experiences growth again, you get more growth and it just keeps compounding. And so it, it can only go up. So which is nice. When you got an account that uh, is not um, affected by market losses and can experience growth when the index goes up, then you've got a pretty decent annuity. And so I, I do tend to favor fixed index annuities because of that, because they, they are able to get uh, a lot more potential growth than maybe a fixed annuity over here, but they also have complete protection against market risk, um, which of course the variable annuity over here does not have. 
So hope that makes sense. I just want to be very short, concise, to the point on these types of annuities. When you're looking for annuities, you have to ask yourself uh, a few questions. Um, are you doing it for guaranteed income? Okay, if you are, then a fixed index annuity with an income rider might be the thing for you. Are you doing it for just a higher rate of return than your bank has given you and, you and you don't need it for income? Then maybe a fixed annuity would be the best thing for you. And, and, and if you're someone where you're like, you know what, I've got tons of money, I've got tons of income, and I could care less what the market does over the next five, 10 years because it's not going to affect me at all and I don't mind the high rates, the high fees potentially in a variable, then maybe a variable would be a good choice for you. So just depends on you, depends on your risk tolerance, depends on what you are looking for. So anyways, if you are looking for guaranteed income, if you're looking for growth, if you're looking for market protection, I'm your guy. And I'd be happy to chat with you. Um, go ahead and book a call in the link below this video and we'll chat. I, I'll uh, ask you questions. You can ask me questions and we'll kind of go over what you're looking for and, and I'll show you all the annuities on the market so you can kind of decide for yourself. So anyways, thanks for watching and we will see you in the next video.